Hello, good uh, morning, evening, afternoon to all those concerned and interested. And now to all those who can take proper action against uh, Marion Williamson, Karachi American School, Matthew, Dr. Todd, Mr. Horton, and uh, Dr. Webster. Moreover, the United States of America, the CIA, NATO organizations, I have uh, bled inside, not only for Ms. Desa, my condition, uh, but also seeing the degeneration of uh, my mother's country, Pakistan. Uh, the United States of America is an infidel, not only anti-Islamic, uh, but uh, anti-humanity, bleeding inside for Pakistan, and then comes Iraq, uh, then comes uh, Syria and uh, Yemen, before that Afghanistan, Pakistan. If the United States of America really wanted sincerely to help us, we would not have seen the further uh, re sorry, uh, degeneration of uh, Pakistan, Afghanistan, we who wanted human prosperity, good quality of life, I have just had enough above my head now. If the people were sincere, uh, we would not have this degeneration of our civilization. I am telling you through experience uh, that uh, these Americans uh, now have reached uh, the top of everything. <laughs> Shaking hands with uh, uh, that uh, devil who told Jesus Christ on the mountain that I can give you everything. You can rule the world. I have experienced going through hell uh, that these Americans are ruthless people. Uh, like I said, I was uh, in the Karachi American School from 1977 uh, to 1983. Instead of bringing two uh, family friends together, Ms. Desai and I, uh, they separated us. They cut us off like uh, so ruthlessly and made sure that uh, I don't see Ms. Desai and Ms. Desa would not see me. Meanwhile, what happened in between, what Ms. Desa had to do and go through, and what I had to do and go through, was uh, some kind of hell that uh, is very chilling for me to go in the past. It's uh, a been, uh, first of all, what a journey. Um, I had to uh, torture myself at times. Um, when I was in the old house, I remember torturing myself uh, to forget Ms. Desa. Therapy wasn't working. And then uh, I remember uh, my brother's graduation. She told me on the phone that she would come. And I told her, wear a sari. I'm wearing a sari, uh, but then she didn't come to my brother's graduation in Karachi American School. So there I was, uh, it was very painful for me. Uh, I think emotional pain is more than physical pain. That's how I felt at that time. So what I did was uh, I stood on my bed and put my hand on the uh, moving fan. However, thank God nothing really happened to my hand in the sense that there was no serious injury. 
Now you see, Ms. Desa had taught me from uh, my childhood uh, that to mean what I say and to say what I mean. This was uh, drilled in me. And during the separation period in therapy, I told my doctors, I want to become like Ms. Desa wants me to become. Uh, that if she would slap my one cheek, I would give her the other cheek and uh, go on respecting her and honoring her as uh, she was an elderly. So another deep shock uh, in, uh, I think, 1988 May or, no, 1989 May, my brother graduated. And uh, Miss Desa had told me she would come, but then she didn't come, and I thought uh, she had uh, deceived me. Then um, when I spoke to her on the phone, she told me that she had some work to do, and therefore she couldn't make it. Have you read uh, Khalil Gibran's, uh, I think it's Honey Poisoned, uh, uh, something and it says in the end how clever you are Ferris I'm uh, sorry I can't explain myself uh, clearly and uh, uh, the thing eloquently because uh, my I've been deteriorating since a long time I saw myself deteriorating in O levels also and um, many times I used to tell my therapist that I'm deteriorating. So please don't you see if you can see that uh, the Americans actually want us to degenerate and also be in such grief that we would uh, be completely helpless and not able to help ourselves. Uh, this is what has happened in Pakistan, Afghanistan, Syria, uh, Palestine, uh, Iraq. They've come into my holy cities, uh, the Shia holy cities uh, for pilgrimage in Iraq. First it was that Saddam Hussein who killed many, many uh, um, Shia scholars and uh, people also got uh, Sayyid Hakim, uh, Sayyid Hakim's son, Sayyid Mahdi al Hakim, assassinated in uh, Africa. Uh, Saddam Hussein's Baathist party. Sayyid Mahdi al Hakim was in Dubai. I met him. And then he went to Africa and we heard he was mar martyred. Saddam Hussein was killing many Shias in Iraq and wouldn't even allow us to go to uh, Imam Hussein's uh, Rosa pilgrimage uh, place. Mausoleums and tombs. The thing I want to mention here is that uh, I'm not into any political party uh, or political aims, uh, even in religion. I see the Hindus uh, loving their, I mean, my God, uh, the way they love their gods. Uh, they have been faithful uh, to their ancient teachings. And uh, so nothing of politics uh, do I want to bring in my religion and my faith. I admire all those people who sincerely uh, are religious, who uh, love God. Uh, there are just uh, very many ways of uh, worshipping God, and the Hindus have their own way. So I don't want to bring any politics in this. Uh, my aim is... Uh, for the good and welfare of uh, humanity, what uh, you may come from, any religion, any faith, uh, but uh, the thing is, uh, I admire that, and it doesn't uh, 
affect me what uh, you worship as long as you are true to your worship your way of worship and you love god and you think about humanity you want to bring peace and prosperity you don't want to hurt uh, people's feelings hearts damage houses um you want to bring a uh, good uh, prosperity quality of life to the people to humanity alleviate their sufferings and this is for me true religion and uh, true worship right now our enemies uh, would want us to get into these uh, terrible debates caught up in speeches and useless debates um when we should be helping humanity uh, earth is burning and the united states of america is responsible much responsible for a burning of the earth and uh, fueling the fire between brotherly nations as we can see it has done in the middle east and get us all confused and uh, you know like uh, i you uh, became where is god and uh, then what is the true faith where are our prayers going even my therapist said asked uh, where are our prayers going she was praying for me as well as doing therapy so uh thank you much for being here with me and i will continue later inshallah god bless you all amen and uh, protect you all from the evil of uh, this time these times i mean